So let's keep this as simple as humanly possible. You want more followers on Instagram, but more importantly, you want those followers to actually be people that are interested in what you're posting about. You don't want bots or fake followers, which is exactly why you're watching this video right now, because in this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you the four things that you need to be doing differently if you wanna increase the followers you're getting right now on Instagram in 2023. And I'm talking about using the right features on Instagram, participating in the right trends, where to find those trends, and one other secret that's going to completely transform your account. In fact, this creator just implemented these tips and gained over 50,000 followers in just 30 days. And this creator implemented these tips and gained over 700,000 followers. And the same thing can happen to you if you simply implement each one of these tips, but more importantly, don't skip any because the last one is by far the most important. Step number one is you need to go to your professional dashboard and you need to be looking at what is actually trending broadly on Instagram. And there are two places for you to find this. First, you can find the Reels trends, which is simply going to be the hashtags that are trending broadly on Instagram, but then also the sounds that are trending broadly on Instagram. And then the second place you can look is going into other creators like you. And what this is gonna allow you to do, it's going to allow you to increase the reach of your current post because these other creators that are like you might be uploading in a different format. They might be uploading in a different length, or they might be uploading some different type of content. So you being able to mix this type of content into the content you're currently creating is going to expand the audience that you're going to be able to reach. And ultimately, it's going to allow you to reach new people that might not be interacting with fitness content right now, but are interested in fitness or might not be interacting with affiliate marketing content. You guys get the point. If you're able to interact with these broad people that are still closely related to what your niche is going to be about, it's going to skyrocket both the amount of followers that you're getting and the amount of people that are actually interested in your content, but we can't stop there. I also need to make sure that you're participating in the niche specific trends, but before I can share with you exactly where they are, I need you to smash that subscribe button. If you wanna go quick on Instagram, TikTok, or YouTube, I literally upload a video every single day about how to grow on these platforms. In addition to that, I just created a free Instagram growth course. You can get the pinned comment below. It's gonna share with you things like the best hashtag strategies to use, which by the way, I just gave you amazing hashtags, but now you need to know how many of them to actually use. So please go to the pinned comment below and get into that right now. So in order to find the niche specific trends, you don't need to look in that many places. In the past, you had to go into the hashtags or you had to try to find big creators within your niche, but that's not the case anymore. In fact, they made it incredibly easy. All you have to do now is do a simple search for something in your niche and what's going to happen. You're going to see the For You page open up and this is gonna share with you two things. First, what photos and carousels are trending within your niche, but secondly, what reels are trending within your niche and you can't stop there. The reason being, if you click into one of those photos, click into one of those carousels or click into one of those reels, it is going to completely transform your feed. And the only thing that you're going to see is things that are trending for your niche. Now, what should you do with this? You should stitch these videos. You should duet these videos. You should recreate these videos. And no, I'm not telling you to copy the content that these creators are doing. But if you see a format that does well or a hook that does well, you should probably implement that into your content so that you can increase the views you're getting. Let me ask you a question. So many people approach social media the wrong way when they should simply be approaching it the same way that you would learn how to play music. If you were just learning how to play the piano for the first time, would you go and try to create your own song? No. You wouldn't. You would start with Mary Had a Little Lamb and then maybe something a little harder, then something a little harder, and then maybe you could play one of Billy Joel's songs. But you wouldn't just go and create your own music from the get-go. So why do people think that they should do that with social media? Instead, you should look at what's actually trending broadly on Instagram or niche-specific on Instagram and recreate those posts except make them different. Use your own personality, air your own flair to it, and this is what people are gonna fall in love with you for. But I will warn you, there are two other things that you need to make sure that you're doing, like looking at the right analytics and using the right features. And I'm about to share that with you, but beforehand, I need to make sure that you understand something. This opportunity that we're seeing right now, it's so much organic reach on Instagram, and you could literally have zero followers and get a million views on a post. It's not going to last forever, so you need to make sure that you're taking advantage of it. Now, when it comes to the analytics, there are two analytics I want you to pay attention to. One, the amount of watch time that you're getting, and secondly, whether or not followers are seeing your content or non-followers. Ideally, you want to optimize for the lengths that are going to allow you to get as close to 100% watch time as possible without the video being three seconds long. And you want to be optimizing for the formats, the topics, and also the lengths that are getting you the most non-follower reach. The reason being, if you want to increase your followers on Instagram, which obviously you do because you're watching this video, you need to make sure that you're reaching non-followers because if you're not reaching non-followers, you're going to lose followers. But it's also a clear sign to Instagram that people in your niche that are creating content on the topic that you're 
creating on are better at creating content than you because they're able to attract new people to their account. If you're not able to do this, it's just going to hold you back because Instagram is pushing content like crazy that gets non-follower reach, which is why you need to be paying attention to this analytic and more specifically, the length of the posts that are working, the topics of the posts that are working, and the formats of the posts that are working because instead of you saying, oh, this worked, I'm not gonna do this ever again, you need to double down on whatever it is that's working. Now this brings me to the last and most important point about Instagram, which is that Instagram has changed a bunch of features that they offer. First and foremost, they changed their editor. Now the editor is a lot more complex. You could do so many different things in it, like add an audio, add text, add clips. You could even cut things out. And what does this mean? It means that Instagram clearly wants you to edit your content more. And I'm not saying you need to edit it within the app, but they realized that in order for them to be competitive against TikTok and against YouTube, their content that's on the platform needs to be more highly edited because it holds people attention longer, so they're trying to give you the tools to be able to do that. In addition, the green screen feature, I cannot emphasize enough. You need to make sure that you're doing this feature, and then finally, you need to make sure that you're adding topics when you're posting about something. You should be choosing three relevant topics so that Instagram knows what kind of audience they should seed that piece of content with to see whether or not they enjoy it, because if they enjoy it, then there's an opportunity for it to get pushed out to more people. Now, if you want me to look at your account and tell you everything that I know about Instagram and exactly how to grow your account, from what content to post to what has hashtags to use, to what time to post, and you want me to critique your content to guarantee that you grow on Instagram in the next 30 days, like how I helped this creator gain over 700,000 followers and this creator over 50,000 followers, well then please keep watching this video because I've got a special offer for you. The opportunity to grow on Instagram and this organic reach we're currently seeing are not gonna last forever. And there are two things holding you back from seeing the growth like the creators that I share with you in this video. The first one is that you haven't implemented the tips that I just shared with you. And the second is that you haven't gotten into my Instagram mentorship program yet. That's literally gonna guarantee that I help you get more followers on Instagram in the next 30 days or you get your money back zero questions asked. In fact, the average person that's gone through this program in the last 30 days has gained over 25,000 followers and nobody has ever gone through it and gained less than a thousand followers if they implement to every piece of advice that I share with them. Now, since you're still watching this video, I'm gonna assume you're probably above average. So the odds of you gaining over 25,000 followers are probably quite high. And if you want results like that, go to the link in the description below right now and sign up because there are limited spots available. I'm gonna be telling you exactly what to post, when to post, what hashtags to use. I'm gonna send you new post ideas and I'm gonna critique your content to guarantee that you get more growth on Instagram in the next 30 days. It doesn't matter what your niche is or what your background is, this program is gonna help you get followers more easily and quicker so that you don't have to spend endless hours trying to figure out the things that I already know about exactly how to grow your account. In fact, they just helped this creator in the program and they gained over 100,000 followers in just 30 days. I helped this creator, they gained over 150,000 and this creator over 200,000 followers. If you want results like that and I want you to be my next success story, go to the link in the description below and sign up right now because every single day that you wait, it's only going to get harder to grow on Instagram. It is easier than ever to grow right now, but you need to take advantage of this opportunity. And what's better than an opportunity where you're literally going to grow on Instagram or get your money back because zero questions asked. Again, there are limited spots, so go to the link in the description below and sign up right now. Otherwise, I strongly suggest you check out the next two videos I put up on the screen because they're the videos YouTube thinks you should watch next. Thank you so much for watching.